Okay. Okay, guys, let's get started. Happy Monday. Hope you're all feeling well after this snowstorm. Um, welcome. My name is Lisa. I'm subbing for Kay tonight. We're going to begin standing at six o'clock. So let's get started. Bringing your feet hip width apart at the top of the mat. Just make your feet parallel to each other. Arms beside you. And just bring your hands to your heart. Close the eyes. Roll the shoulders away from your ears. Take a few moments here to settle in, to realign your body, head over heart, heart over pelvis, hips over knees, knees over ankles. Start to connect to the four corners of your feet. Start to really root them down, anchoring, grounding, and just connecting inwards. Start to activate the legs with a little bit of activations by squeezing the muscles around the bones. Begin to elongate your spine as if you were being pulled up by the crown of your head. See if you can grow an inch. Just get a little taller, a little longer. Begin to elongate your tailbone towards the earth. Have a soft bend in your knees, connecting all 10 toes in the center of your heels. And then go ahead and softly open the eyes, release your arms by your side. Take a deep breath in, lift your shoulders to your ears and exhale, roll them down the back. Let's do that two more times. Take a deep breath in, lift the shoulders up and then exhale, roll them back, create more space. One more time, deep breath in, lift. And then exhale, roll the shoulders back. Good. On your next inhalation, lift your arms, lift your heels, reach for the ceiling, reach for the sky. Exhale, bend the knees and, and just swing the arms back. Let's do that a few more times. Inhale, lift, high on the toes. Exhale, inhale, lift, find your balance. Exhale, two more times. Inhale, lift, exhale. One more, inhale, lift, exhale, stay low. Keep your arms behind you like jet airplane arms. Pull the chest forward. Keep the spine nice and long. Hold and breathe for five, four, three, two, and one. Go ahead and grab your ankles here. And we're gonna do this for about 30 seconds. It goes like this. Bend the knees to your own degree and then fold. So bend and fold. So grab your ankles or your calves and just start moving at your own pace. Start to warm up your joints, your knee joints, the backs of your legs. Start to really create some heat in your thigh muscles, in your quads. So keep moving, keep breathing. As you breathe in, bend the knees, exhale out, fold over, in and out. So keep moving, keep breathing at your own pace. We're just building some heat here, guys. Hold your ankles or hold your calves wherever it feels good. Keep moving, keep breathing. Start to feel the muscles in your legs, pumping blood, oxygen to the heart, to your organs. For 10, Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Good. Release the hands to the mat. Grab opposite elbows. You come into a ragdoll. Keep a soft bend in your knees. And allow your spine to decompress. Let your head be heavy. Stay connected to the four corners of your feet and just get really loose and long in your spine. Good. And then from here, release your hands to the mat. Heel toe your feet as wide as the mat, parallel to each other. Keep your left hand on the ground and take a deep breath in. Reach your right arm to the sky. Look up to the ceiling. Look up to your right hand and hold. 
Good. Activate your legs. Press down through your feet. Lengthen your spine. Squeeze your belly. Open your chest. Open your arms nice and wide for five, four, three, two, and one. Good. Exhale. Release your right hand to the mat. Inhale, left arm to the sky, go slow, really open up, feel your body here. Looking up to that top hand if it feels good for five. Keep pressing down through your feet, keep your legs activated. Four, squeeze the navel, three, two, and one, good. Exhale, left hand comes back to the mat, interlace your fingers on your low back. Take a deep breath in and stretch the arms away from your back. Release the head. Just give your head a little shake. Yes, yes, yes. No, no, no. Hold and breathe. Bend the knees as much as you need to for five, four, three, two, and one. Good. Release your hands to your hips as you exhale and inhale. Come up with the flat back. Lead with your chin. We're coming up slow. That's it. Good. And then exhale to release. Soften the knees and make circles with your hips in one direction. Kind of get into your hips. They don't have to be big circles. Whatever feels good. A couple more times here. Just find your periphery, go around the edges and reverse. So rolling the hips guys here, for those just jumping on, feel the pelvis, good. One more circle here. Good. And then coming back to center, step your feet off the mat now. Turn your toes out, bend your knees, take your right elbow to right thigh, and inhale, left arm over your head and stretch, hold. Create a little bit of tension in your feet, about 10% to keep your legs activated. Lift your sternum out of your navel and hold and stretch for five. Turn your right palm to the sky and press your elbow into your thigh. Try not to shrug into the shoulder. Four. Find your equal weight distribution through the center, through the midline. Three. Keep the neck long. Two. And one. Good. Exhale. Switch. Stay low. Inhale. Stretch that right arm over your head. Open your chest. For five, strong feet, activate feet, four, three, externally rotate your thighs, two, and one. Good, exhale to release, take your hands on both of your thighs here, shrug your shoulders. Take a deep breath in to lengthen, as you exhale, push into your left inner leg, slowly twist your spine, look up to the ceiling, hold and breathe. Externally rotate your thighs for five. So we're just building a little bit of heat through the legs, four. Create more length in your spine, three. Relax your face, two. And one, good. Inhale, come back to midline through the center and exhale, push into that right inner leg. Go slow from the bottom of your spine, turn your head last. Strong legs. Tuck the tail slightly for five. Hug your hips, four, three, two, and one. Good, inhale, release. Lift the arms over your head, straighten the legs, reach up, exhale, bend the knees, hands to your heart. Again, inhale, sweep the arms up, exhale, bend the knees, sitting down. Few more times, inhale, stretch up, exhale, hands to heart, goddess god pose. Deep breath in, big circle, stretch up, exhale, hold and breathe. Lift your left heel off the ground for five, four, press into your hands, three, two, 
and one and switch. Drop the left heel, lift your right heel, hold for five, four, should be able to feel those legs now. Three, two, and one. Good, exhale, drop. Inhale, slowly power up your legs, reach your arms to the sky, and exhale, float your arms down, heel toe, heel toe, feet all the way together, top of the mat. Take a deep breath in, sweep the arms over your head, exhale, interlace the fingers, turn your palms away, stretch your arms to the right, hips to the left, standing crescent moon pose, strong navel, pull it in and up. Long neck, good, for five, ground your feet equally. Feel that side stretch, four, three, open the armpits nice and wide, two, and one. Good, inhale, rise up, and exhale over to the left, hips to the right, soften the knees. Good, lift your navel, lift your whole rib cage out of the waist for five, Keep the face off, keep the breath coming. Four, three, two, and one. Good, inhale, lift to the top and exhale, bend back. Just to your own degree, look up to the ceiling, hold for five, strong body, whole body is connected. Four, three, two, and one, inhale to the top, exhale, bend the knees, release the arms, take your jet airplane arms again. So pull the arms back, pull your hands back, pull the chest forward, sit into that stool just a little lower. Take your hands to your heart, twist to the right, hook your elbow on the knee, squeeze the belly, another twist here, open up your chest, Turn your face last, your head last for five, four. Keep pressing into your hands with equal weight distribution. Three, use your hands as leverage. Two, and one. Good, exhale to release, stay low. Switch sides, hook your elbow. As you inhale, slowly twist, squeeze your navel. Look up for five four, that's it, you got it, three, two, and one, good, exhale to release, hands to the mat, walk your feet to the plank, find your plank, shoulders over hands, heels over toes, squeeze your legs, they're already activated here, so feel the muscles squeezing around the bones, Tighten your tummy, tighten your shoulders now, tighten your arms. Slightly look forward for five. Grip your mat with your fingers like a volleyball. Four, activate your upper arms, your biceps and triceps. Three, two, and one. Inhale, shift to tippy toes. Exhale, bend the elbows, we're coming all the way down into the baby cobra so point your toes just lift your head and your chest only take jet airplane arms like we've been doing reach the hands back towards the back of your mat hold feel the strength of your spine for five four that's it three two and one good exhale hands spring the chest Inhale, press up, and exhale, come to the table. Stack your shoulders over your hands again, hips over knees. Good, cats and cows. Take a deep breath in, drop your belly, lift your hips and your head, arch your back. Exhale, round your back, hollow your belly, curl the chin. Take a deep breath in, arching, lift your heart, your chin. Exhale, feel your hands, lengthen your arms, round your back. Keep moving, keep breathing at your own pace. Close the eyes down and just feel your spine, feel your hips, feel the pelvis. Link your breath with movement. 
See if you can soften, see if you can lengthen and open. So just a few more cycles here. Feel your body. Stay present, feel the power of presence when you focus on this pose. Linking breath. Good. And then coming back to center, tuck your toes, send your hips back towards your heels, start to wake up your feet. And if you wish to go deeper, sit on your heels. We're not gonna be here long, but give the soles of your feet a good little stretch and your toes. For five, four, as you soften, it creates more space. Three, breathe into it, two, and one. Good, exhale, walk your hands forward, keep your toes tucked. Inhale, pick up your hips, downward facing dog. Find your first downward facing dog. Start to pedal your feet, walk your dog on the spot. Move your hips a little from side to side, whatever feels good. Get a sense of pushing the floor away from you through your hands, get nice and long through the arms. Good, and then come back to a static downward facing dog. Inhale, lift your heels and roll forward like a wave to plank again. Shoulders over hands, exhale, push back. Downward facing dog. Inhale, hollow your belly, ripple forward to plank with control. Exhale, push back and lengthen down dog. Two more. Take a deep breath in like a wave. Come forward to plank, strong hands. Exhale, long arms down dog. Last one. Inhale, roll forward, shift to plank. Exhale, lower down, all the way, inner strength. That's it. Roll the shoulders back again. And when you're ready, inhale, slowly peel the front of your spine. Vertebra by vertebra into your cobra. Find your own peak here. Soften the elbows, hold and breathe. Like a cobra rears up its head. Use the weight of your legs and your pelvis for five. Tucking the tail, four, open the heart, three, soften your throat, two, and one. Good, exhale, lower down, tuck your toes, inhale, upper push up, go back to plank, and exhale, lift your hips, downward facing dog. Good, inhale, lift your right leg to the sky, three-legged dog. Exhale, bend your top knee, flip your hip open. Take a peek underneath your left armpit. See if you can find your right foot in the periphery. Hold and breathe. Press into the hands, equal weight distribution. Good, take one more deep breath in here to open that hip and exhale, right knee to right elbow, shift to plank, strong core. Inhale, three-legged dog, leg to the sky. Exhale, knee to nose, curl your chin. Inhale, leg to the sky, three-legged dog. Exhale, right knee to left elbow, squeeze and twist. Inhale, right leg to the sky. Exhale, step your right foot top of the mat. Drop your left knee, keep your left toes tucked, press and flow, find your feet. Inhale, arms reach up to the sky, open your heart. Exhale, half splits. Right leg is straight, bow over that leg. Let's flow, inhale, lift arms, soft focus. Exhale, lengthen and fold. Deep breath in, sweep the arms up. Exhale, flex your toes, lengthen. Two more, take a nice deep breath in like a dance. Exhale, flex and fold. Last one, take a deep breath in, reach up. Exhale, folding, folding, folding. Good, inhale, shift the weight forward. Exhale, pick up that back knee. Inhale, right arm to the sky, squeeze the belly again. 
See if you can create more space in this twist. Hug your legs, hug your sit bones for five, four, three, two, and one. Good, exhale, right hand to the mat. Listen carefully, inhale, left foot steps to the top of the mat, feet together. Exhale, fold over your legs. Inhale, halfway up, flat back, lift the heart. Exhale, crease and fold. Again, in inhale, lift the heart, halfway up. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, arms reach up to the sky, come up slowly, look to thumbs, and exhale, hands to your heart. Take a deep breath in, sweep the arms up, and exhale, sweep them behind you, interlace your fingers there. Roll the shoulders back. Inhale, lift your left knee up, find your balance, and exhale, straighten that left leg. Do what you can here. Hold and breathe for five, four, three, two, and one. Exhale, left foot meets right foot. Release the arms. Take a deep breath in. Sweep the arms to the sky. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, halfway up, flat back. Exhale to the plank. Shift to tippy toes, chaturanga, dandasana, or all the way down, your choice. Inhale to the cobra or up dog. Exhale, lift your hips, downward facing dog. Inhale, left leg reaches up, three-legged dog. Exhale, bend your left knee, flip that hip open. Take a peek underneath your right armpit. See if you can see the left foot. Pressing into your hands, create more length. Ground your right foot. Take a nice deep breath in to open that hip. Exhale, left knee to left elbow, shift to plank, strong core. Inhale, three-legged dog. Exhale, knee to nose, dome your back. Inhale, leg to the sky. Exhale to the right elbow, squeeze and twist. Inhale, leg to the sky. Exhale, step your left foot on top of the mat. Drop your right knee. Find your feet in your base, press it flow. Inhale, lift your arms, drop your hips, press it lunge. Exhale, half splits. Left leg is straight, head to knee. Take a deep breath in, have a soft focus. Exhale, hollow your belly, flex. Inhale, reach the arms up, feel the flow. Exhale, strong navel. Good, two more. Inhale, reach up. Exhale, hollow the belly. Last one. Take a deep breath in, reach the arms up. Exhale, fold and flex. Inhale, shift forward, plant your hands. Exhale, pick up your right knee. Inhale, slowly twist from the base of your spine. Turn your head last, look up to your top hand. Level your hips and squeeze your sit bones together for five strong legs, four strong hips. Three, long arms, two, and one. Good, exhale, left hand to the mat. Inhale, right foot meets left foot, top of the mat. Exhale, fold over your legs. Inhale, lift your heart, halfway up. Exhale, crease and fold. Last one. Take a deep breath in, lift the heart, lengthen out. Exhale, crease and fold. Inhale, arms reach up to the sky, stretch up, and exhale, float your hands behind your back, just like we did, interlace the fingers there. Inhale, roll the shoulders back, and when you're ready, float your right knee up. Flex your right toes, and then straighten that right leg to your own degree. Squeeze the arms, soft focus. Laser sharp focus for five, four, three, 
two and one good exhale right foot meets left foot release the hands take a nice deep breath in stretch up palms back reach back if it feels good exhale forward fold inhale halfway up flat back exhale to the plank shift to tippy toes chaturanga dandasana hug those elbows inhale lift the heart up dog and exhale lift your hips downward facing dog inhale right leg to the sky three-legged dog exhale step your right foot top of the mat spin the back foot flat inhale warrior one rise up sweep the arms over your head that's it exhale take your hands behind your back again interlace your fingers inhale roll the shoulders back lift the sternum and with control humble warrior lead with your heart drop the chest on the inside of your right leg reach the knuckles away from your back strong feet strong legs look to your back foot for five four three two and one good inhale we come all the way up to the top straighten that front leg with control you got it release the arms take a nice deep breath in sweep the arms to the top and exhale dip it to that front knee warrior one hold and breathe take any arm variation that feels good here cactus or palms touch for five straighten that back leg nice and strong four three upper bodies like a blade two and one exhale vinyasa take it all the way through to the dog go at your own pace link your breath with movement try not to think about it just get into your body and breath downward facing dog left side stay with me inhale left leg to the sky three-legged dog exhale lightly step it top of the mat spin the back foot flat warrior one inhale rise up float your arms over your head exhale float them behind your back interlace your fingers inhale roll the shoulders back lift the heart and like a wave like a waterfall exhale lead with your heart take your time soft focus drop the head look to your back toes squeeze your shoulders for five four strong navel there's no dead weight three two and one good inhale slowly rise up straighten the front leg release the hands when you're at the top and take a deep breath in sweep the arms up exhale dip into that front knee find your center of gravity hold here take any arm variation for five four take a peek at your left knee make sure it's externally rotating three two and one good inhale arms to the sky and exhale take a vinyasa all the way through to the dog we'll meet in downward facing dog link your breath with movement good downward facing dog walk your hands to your feet to the back of the mat hook your big toes with your first two fingers inhale lift your heart flat back Exhale, pull on the toes, chest to thighs, curl the chin in, hold and breathe. Activate your feet for five, four, three, two, and one good inhale lift your heart flat back look forward exhale walk to the plank when you land in plank take a nice deep breath in to lengthen and exhale roll your heels to the right 
Slowly as you inhale, lift your left arm up to the sky with control. No dead weight. Squeeze your whole body for five. Keep your neck long, face soft. Four, three, two, and one. Exhale slowly to the plank, gracefully. Roll your heels to the left. And when you're ready, take flight. Lift your right arm up as you inhale for five. Spread those fingers wide. Four, three, two, and one. Good, exhale to the plank. Lower all the way down with inner strength. Bend both knees, reach back, grab the tops of your feet. Get ready for bow pose or take the cobra, forehead to the mat. Take a nice deep breath in, lift your heart, lift your legs, press your feet into your hands. Separate the collarbones nice and wide for five, four, three. Feel your whole body. Two, and one. Good, exhale, release the feet, lower the feet, hands beside your chest. Inhale, we press up to the table, realign your joints, and exhale, float your left foot up to the sky. Reach around, grab the top of your left foot, coming back into that heart opener. Good time to open the heart this time of year. Hold and breathe. Walk with your heart forward for five, four, three, two, and one. Inhale, spinal balance. Extend that right arm forward, left leg back. Tighten your whole body. Squeeze your navel for five, four. Keep the breath coming. Three, listen to your own breathing. Two, and one, good job. Exhale, back to the plank. When you're ready, let's do other side. Inhale, float right foot up. Exhale, reach around, grab what you can. Inhale, lift that foot, lift and open your heart. For five, take your time. It's okay to wobble. It's okay to shake. Four, three, two, and one, good. Inhale, spinal balance with control. Level off your shoulders and your hips for five. Hollow your belly energetically, four. Squeeze whole body, three, two, and one. Good, exhale, come back to the table. Tuck your toes, last down dog. Inhale, lift your hips. Stretch out your arms, stretch out your spine. Realign your body, breath, and mind. Good. Inhale, lift your heels. Exhale, bend the knees, look forward, step or float, feet to hands. Inhale, lift your heart halfway up. Exhale, crease and fold. Inhale, bend the knees, drop your hips, lift your arms to the sky. As you inhale, sit in the chair, make your arms like a V. Open your palms, your fingers, your heart here. Hold and breathe for five. Feel the strength of your legs. Feel the strength of your spine. Open heart, four, three, two, and one, inhale, power up your legs, volcano pose. Reach up, lift your heart, open your solar plexus, look up to the ceiling, and exhale, float your arms down. Good. Step your feet off your mat again, but keep them parallel to each other, not turned out like the goddess pose. Listen carefully. Inhale, lift your arms over your head, turn your palms up, and touch your middle fingers. Just reach the middle fingers towards each other. We're gonna go to the left. As you exhale, fold forward, swoop around, and come back up. Try to keep your fingertips connected. Go around again. 
Strong legs, feel your spine. This is a Qigong practice. I incorporate Qigong into my practices, into my yoga. So move around just a couple of more times. Feel your body, feel the feet. One more time this side. Good, come back up to the top. Take a nice deep breath in, realign, and then to the right. Try to keep those hands above your head. Good, keep moving, keep breathing about five times at your own pace. Keep the eyes open for balance and stability. Two more. One more. Come all the way up to the top, that's it. Release the arms. Heel toe your feet to the edges of your mat. Turn the toes out, hands to your heart. Squeeze the buttocks here. Feel your legs. Pull the energy up. Take a nice deep breath in. Now soften. Bend the knees, soften down. Nice and easy. Nice and slow. Get the control, feel the landing, nice and soft. Arms on the inside, palms together. Tuck the chin, bow to your fingertips here. Close the eyes, go inside. Feel your body. Add a little bit of resistance through your feet, about 10%, just to keep the legs active. Draw the energy up through the soles of your feet. Feel it through the feet, lifting the spine for five, four. Slow down your breathing. Consciously breathe, breathe. Two. And one, good. Inhale, softly open the eyes and exhale, sitting down. Drop your seat, hook your big toes. Let's come into a balance. First two fingers, find your balance, find your focus, and just for fun, push your toes into your fingers. It's okay to roll back, it's okay to wobble and shake. Just find somewhere that you can focus on, on the wall, on the ceiling, on the floor for five, Four, three, two, and one. Now slowly bring the legs together with control. Do what you can, bend the knees if you need to. And when the legs are together, hold here. Push your toes into your fingers, fingers into toes for five, four, three, two and one keep the legs where they are release the arms come into the boat palms face each other do what you can bend the knees if you need to for five four three two and one bend the knees lower your feet give yourself a hug pull the belly into your thigh sit nice and tall as you inhale lengthen up and exhale to release. Coming down onto your back, ease your way down. Bring the soles of your feet together. Supta Baddha Konasana, take cactus arms. Close the eyes down. Make yourself comfortable. So there's nothing for the muscles to do here. So take these next few moments to really integrate the practice into this pose by softening the pelvic floor and the groin and the hips, by releasing your spine and the back of your head. Feel the weight of your arms. Fingers are naturally curling inwards, soft face. And feel the expansion as you inhale across the ribs, 
across the solar plexus and the chest. And feel the softness of your belly as you exhale. Feel the depth of your breathing, the depth, the length and the depth and the quality. Just another minute or two here. Feel free to soften into the pose. We're not using any muscles. So give them permission to stop working, to unstick from the bones and the joints. Just let them fall. Feel your body separating energetically on the inside. Notice what happens to the breath when you unstick the body, the insides. Just letting go of all the tension. And see if you can relax 10 to 15% even more now for the last minute. Get very, very loose, very, very soft, limp, and spacious. Allow the floor to do all the work. And when you're ready, Go ahead and slide one leg out, comfortably apart, taking the pose of Shavasana. Bring the arms close in, keep the heat in, arms beside you, nice and close, palms facing up. And just maybe separate the legs just a couple of inches. Let's see if you can feel this nice long line. Feel the length of your body. Feel how everything is connected from the tips of your toes to your temples. See if you can practice full body breathing just for the next few moments. Feel your whole body breathing. The breath is what heals. The breath is what strengthens your body and your immune system. It's the breath that calms the mind and empties the nervous system. It's the breath that realigns all systems. Feel your whole body breathing. Just notice what and how much space you created from your practice for that full body breath. Good. And when you're ready, begin to wiggle toes and fingers. Slide your legs together one at a time. Stretch the arms behind your head. Take that last good breath in. Hold the breath and stretch and get even longer from toes to temples and everything in between. And then exhale to release. Just rolling over to your left side, the inside, the opposite of the full moon tonight. And uh, slowly press yourself up to sit. Take your time and come into easy pose. And sitting nice and tall, bring your palms together in front of your heart. Lift your heart into your thumbs and just feel that space. Feel your body now, not comparing it to the beginning of class, but just observing 
without judgment, without expectations, without knowing the outcome. And then go ahead and bow to yourself. Namaste, thank you. So thank you, thank you, thank you, everyone. It was a pleasure teaching tonight. I was happy to sub for Kay. So thanks for joining me. I realized I was trying to press the screen at- uh... Thank you. Oh, you're welcome. Really great, thank you. Thank, thank you. you. Thanks so much, guys. Enjoy your night. Have a beautiful sleep.